Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another GTA Online video. My name is Saints Fan, and today I want to take a look at the top five Arena Wars Part 2 vehicles Rockstar can make in GTA Online. This is obviously just my subjective list. If you have any suggestions of your own, please let me know in the comment section below. And if you want to see this stuff, as always, drop the video a like, let Rockstar know. I kind of chose all over the place, taking some inspiration from Mad Max, inspiration from apocalyptic stuff, and even some futuristic stuff. So I think we got a good balance here. Starting us off, though, the Tempesta. This would be a weaponized Tempesta. As you can see here, this one is definitely more of like that apocalyptic vibe. And I know there's going to be some people out there, some car enthusiasts who are like, dude, that is the most hideous thing ever. And sure, whatever. But we got to think this is going to be arena vehicles. So this this vehicle, let's say this hypothetical vehicle or these five hypothetical vehicles, they're going to have three different customization options. You're going to have the apocalypse one. You're going to have the future one and you're going to have the crazy one. I forget what they're called in the game like we have with some of the other ones. Now, this one for the Tempesta, this is this would just be the apocalyptic one. And no, this doesn't have like weapons or anything, but they could introduce some cool things like maybe up here on the top. Maybe that's like a super bright light. That is something that you can use instead of NOS. You can use this super bright light that stuns people. Or maybe that's like a portable EMP. People are near you. You hit it. It's obviously on a cooldown and it EMPs people. I think that would be really awesome, especially maybe if this this vehicle, this arena vehicle didn't have any sort of weapons like it was just a defensive vehicle but because it's a supercar and it goes so damn fast that's like its specialty that would be cool here's another sort of kind of similar look i mean <laughs> the sort of rusted down look on the, the lamborghini here maybe like one of these up in the engine part maybe that's like shooting grenades or something or smoke grenades again this could be a defensive vehicle because it's a supercar so it's faster than everything else so you don't get the offensive powers but Get the defensive ones that would be freaking awesome uh and then well we also have this here this is sort of another similar look this is kind of or this is a vehicle i think we only have like one sort of hatchback in the game but they could do something again like that i thought this was another cool picture to share with you guys but as you might have just seen there for a second the next vehicle if you've played twisted metal you know what this is sweet tooth this would be perfect for the taco truck. I know we kind of already have a few vehicles like this. Like we have uh, this right here, right? This is the the armored mule, I believe, but it's not very good. Like this could pass for an arena vehicle, but it's just not good. It needs to be better. So they could make the or they can make sweet tooth. Obviously, they have to tweak some things to not uh, get like sued or whatever for copyright and all that. But we have some crazy clown masks in the game, right? Just take that, make it a topper for the taco truck. And then you see we obviously have, uh, you know, some guns on it. I'm sure they could add some other guns. But how awesome would it be to have the freaking taco truck or to have this sort of truck in, in GTA Online? Again, this is an ice cream truck converted. But in GTA Online, it would probably be the taco truck because that's like the closest we have to it. And like... This is, is so awesome, man. You have the spikes up on the front to spike people. Obviously, there'd be a little bit more customization rocks that could throw in. But this would be such an awesome vehicle. It might not be the best. Like, I'm sure because it's a freaking taco truck, it wouldn't be that great. However, just having this in the game, man, hitting people with a freaking clown on your giant truck would be hilarious. The third vehicle is a station wagon. Now, the resolution on these, some of these pictures are kind of bad because they're kind of old pictures. I believe this is also from Twisted Metal, but this is a freaking station wagon combined with a tank. And they did that with a few vehicles. I believe they made one of the cars into like a limo that's on giant wheels. So they could totally do that with the station wagon. We all know the station wagon sucks in the game. So having it added on top of, of tank tracks would be great. We have rockets up top. We have mini guns. You know, there's a, there's a lot of different things you could do with this sort of station wagon. And and if we're looking at one of the other styles, 
this could be like the futuristic style or maybe this is that crazy colored style with a giant ufo topper on the top maybe this is the one that shoots energy ammo and obviously maybe they'd have to add again some more weapons and stuff on the side to balance it more with the other arena vehicles but as far as looks go this would be the apocalyptic version and then this would be that future version or one of the other versions and we all know rocks are love they're aliens and this fits perfectly in the game with the aliens and with actually that place up in, near this picture up in sandy shores and maybe this is one you can see at the bottom it shoots flames out the back maybe that's one of its special abilities who knows but that the station wagon would be pretty fun i think now the fourth vehicle we have or this is actually just another take sort of on the station wagon i know this obviously is not a station wagon body but just to give you guys an idea of the tank tracks i just wanted to show that imagine a station wagon on top instead of the muscle car and here's again another picture of that just better resolution i think this is actually from the newest mad max movie but that's basically what it would look like the fourth vehicle the dune buggy now this is way crazy of a concept perhaps but this is insane and this is another one again this would be the apocalyptic version right so this is the one that you would take when you're up in the desert and stuff to live that mad max life but you would also perhaps have let me zoom out here the alien the space docker this would be that futuristic version or the other version we've all been wanting this in the game and i know i, I think they i'm pretty sure they added it with the last arena wars update you could get to like level 100 or level 1000 and you unlock this but come on let's be honest ain't nobody getting to level 1000 to get the freaking space docker it needs to be an arena vehicle it needs to be a vehicle that costs like two three four million dollars it needs to shoot lasers like it needs to shoot stuff from up here on the front up here in the little top part this would be the perfect vehicle for the actual arena wars not just as an unlock but combined with all the arena war customization and again this would be the base car would be the the dune buggy it would convert to this with some crazy weapons and then it would convert to this sort of look as the futuristic version i think that would be awesome and then finally the last vehicle boom now look the resolution of this is terrible but you get an idea of what we're looking at i believe this is from a game in like the 90s that's why it's so bad the taxi or the bel air or i forget what it's called in gta i can't remember all the damn car names but this looks so cool could you imagine being this bright yellow taxi looking vehicle with all kind of crazy guns and spikes and the best part here's actually a more recent recreation of it it hovers maybe it wouldn't hover like fly like the deluxo but that's already in the game right hovering's already in the game this hovers so take this right here obviously this more modern concept with the hovering with the spikes throw on these giant ass weapons we have a giant minigun we have a maybe a an energy weapon over here and then you got missiles over here on the right and boom that's like the perfect arena war part two vehicle I don't know if this would be the apocalypse version probably not because it's floating maybe the, again this could be an exclusive to like that the futuristic version i, I really need to <laughs> go look and see what the hell they're called i'm completely blanking but yeah those were the five vehicles or those are my five vehicles that i wish rockstar would add in the arena wars part two hopefully we do get some more news on that next dlc sometime soon but let me know in the comment section, what do you guys think about these uh, selections that I have chosen? Do you like them? Do you not like them? Do you wish they were in the game or, or you know, how would you make them any better? That's going to do it for this video, though. Thank you all for watching. Please drop a like if you did enjoy it and share it with Rockstar. Put it on their feedback section if you enjoyed it and actually want to see this stuff. I think this one might be the coolest just because of that hover feature. But thank you all. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one.